set in motion. Today is day one of Vlogmas. <laughs> oh my god. Send your stamp approval by sending the spirits of consistency. Please help me so I can get better at vlogging and I can bring you value by entertaining you. Activities of the day. So um, on November 22nd and the 23rd, I got a text from eCitizen letting me know that I should go know that my passport is ready and I need to make an appointment to go pick it up. So I'm going to the cyber so that can help me do that. <laughs> I don't know what I was going to do. Activity number two is I cleaned out my closet. I got rid of a lot of clothes from years past. And I'm taking them to the church so that they can give them away to the less fortunate. Then after that, everything will be a surprise. This is my hairstyle of the day. Something simple, my outfit of the day. Something simple also. It's coming along. Oh my god. Are you pretty? Are you you're so pretty. Oh my god. How pretty are you? I love your bell bell what do you call it bell arms dress mm. i love your dress <laughs> okay i'm gonna stop because i have limited storage but you're so cute what the hell say hi to my people say hi to my friends hi vlog <laughs> <laughs> moment vlog <laughs> moment <laughs> So this is what, these are all my old clothes. Um, you guys can sit with this one in front there. Okay. Because the door wasn't even all that close. When I tell you I really hate this street, oh my god. So now we have to cross. Hold on. I hate this street. Did I mention that? This is it? Says what kind of lounge? So we were at Woodville KFC, packed here while we ran our business at the cyber. So we had to buy ice cream, basically, I guess, because <laughs> they kept hustling us. We could have just gone right now because we didn't need them. Hmm? We didn't need them. You need. You we need. don't. So we're back home because we needed to collect a document, the token number that they gave us after they um after they did what? Like took our pictures. After they took our passport pictures at Nyayo House, um, to to prepare the passport. That right? That's how it was. So we were at the cyber and the guy said, you don't, you, 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 things have changed, you don't collect from Nyayo House anymore. Uh, they sent our, our ready passports to GPO, which is Posta. So now we had to rush back home and get those papers. Yes. First he told me to call... <laughs> Sorry. First he told me to call the contact in my um, eCitizen text message that he sent me and I asked him if he, call, if he could call for me instead and he did. The numbers weren't going through. There were two. Nobody was speaking up. 
But I told me just go to GPR. So we decided we're going to go today, even though that was not in the plans that we're going today because plans change. So yeah, I'm talking fast, but now you're up to date, up to your your caught up. This is a token that they were talking about. So I found the document. Now to go back quickly downstairs and rush there, rush there. So we got stuck in a bit of traffic. Kenya. <laughs> <laughs> That's the Nairobi River. So it's around 3 34, and someone, some of us decided it would be clever to take the clothes first to the church. We have the church. <laughs> so. <laughs> At Old Saints Cathedral, Nairobi. <laughs> it's so peaceful here. I like it. What a beautiful chart. I like how you're nice. I just like how you're such an effortless beauty. It looks nice. Stop that. The dress. The dress. There are the clothes. We're taking them inside. Do you have to go upstairs? No. Oh my god. The second door. The second door. Who are this though? So we were at GPR, they told us we needed to call that number, our email, the number that was sent with the text, the e-citizen text, but I, t I insisted, I told the lady it, the number wasn't going through, so I, I can't really request for them to bring the passport to GPR. So she referred us to City Square, right? City Square Post Office. Yes, that's where they go. Okay, so I hope it's not far. We have 30 minutes to get everything done. We're going up the steps. City Square is over there. Wow, it's so pretty up here. Vending machine. Got it. Oh my god, the East African. Oh. So we came here to Pronto restaurant to celebrate that we got our passports. We're going to reject it. Her cocktail just came with an ice cream on top. Ice cream. Vanilla ice cream. You don't like the combination? What do you think? The avocado. The avocado. Mm -hmm. Because it's, it's too much. Yeah, it's too much. It's just, it's just, it's just like avocado. So will you drink it or they change it? 
Music something you don't like. You can change it. What? As long as you don't like it. Stop, please stop mixing it since they're gonna take it. There's no problem. What is there? Uh, can I taste? Yeah. I can just have it. But if you, if it's too if you don't like it's it. It's just avocado. Avocado I do we eat avocado. Oh. <laughs> Please just give us another drink. Please just give us another drink. Without the avocado. The food is here. So I had ordered pilau along with the Caribbean chicken. They didn't have pilau. They gave me this rice, but it smells really nice. So it's okay. Or City Hall is going to beat us. <laughs> hmm? Or City Hall is going to to beat us. Hmm? That we are enjoying your your. your. Hmm? Hmm? My thingy. Very nice. So what do I do? <laughs> yeah, I'm so sweet. Yeah? yeah, I've already taken you so many. <laughs> it's only me that I haven't taken myself. That lorry is pouring water on the road. How cool is that? Yeah. So we're walking to the church so we can get our car from the parking. <sighs> yeah, Nairobi is beautiful at night. The church is over there. Did you a picture of me? Yeah, I took yeah, a video of me. A video of that. Did you take a picture of me? You mean a video? Okay. Focus. Oh my god. The church. Hey, so I'm back home and the greatest mission of the day has been completed. We got our passport. I am an owner of a passport. You probably won't believe me when I tell you that this is my first ever, 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 ever passport. I've never traveled past, well, anyway. Today was crazy. So when we got to City, I don't know why I keep calling it City Park. City... City, city Square Post Office, or yeah, City Square Post Office. Um, the guard at the door, we got there, um, like I think around 4.40 something, right? Like we had like at least 10 minutes to spare, right? Or even more, maybe 15. Um, we got there and the guard lied to us, telling us that time is up, we better just go home. However, we told him that we were just gonna we were referred to, to City Square and we we're just gonna go in and confirm where we were to return to tomorrow. So he said him he set himself up for that lie. Keep that in mind. Anyway, so we got in and we went to the um to the place where it's designated so that you can get you can collect your passport. It, 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 it even says it has an instructions paper stuck on the wall and it says passport collection. So we went there and this Muslim lady was so nice and she helped us. She helped my mom and we ended up getting our passport. While we were waiting though, there was a bit, because it took some time. We, we went way past 5 p.m. They're closing they close at 5 p.m. So we went way past that, like maybe 5.30. So anyway, while we were waiting for them to go look 
look around for the passports in the back. There was this guy who's really, really impatient. And to, uh, on top of that, there was a, the, the guard that we had told that we were just coming to we were just coming to check and then we'll just come back tomorrow not to carry out any business he came and he was like hey you lied to me i'm gonna fine you um <laughs> long story short that did end up happening however there's another guy there who's like oh my god we're, we're closed just go just go come back tomorrow come back tomorrow um get collect your passport tomorrow and i you know <sighs> This is pandemic time. Nobody has time to keep crisscrossing town. So no, I wasn't moving. And they've been sending me texts telling me my passport is ready. I just wanted to get my passport. I've waited for so long because when we when we started applying, um, we started applying for the passport before COVID hit, and then COVID hit, and we've been waiting all that time because they had to pause to pause production or the whole process, and then they restarted up again like almost at the end of the year. So yeah, I was, no, I was not living without my passport. People have other things to do tomorrow, right? So yeah, he was really like, go, 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 go. But the lady had promised, the Muslim lady had promised to help us. So I just sat there. He even told that security guard who we had fibbed to. He told him, um, can you just, can you just get these people out of here? When I had that, for a second, I considered running away. Then I thought, you know what? It's better, they, they, they can just come, grab me, mop the floor with... Today, I was like, today I'm going to be the mop for, for this... Oh, for this building. They'll mop the floor with me today. <laughs> so I, we stayed put and waited. And just a few seconds later, they gave us the passport. Um, there's an instruction. You, you go to poster ke something like that there's a website that you go to you input your name your id number your your full names your id number and um what else there was that number on the on the on the document that they gave give you after they've taken your picture for the passport. I think that's what they put. Anyway, I can't remember. It was such a, a crazy situation. Anyway, so you just put in those details and then they, they give you a pay bill. They, they, they give you payment information that you pay through M-Pesa. Oh yeah, you input your phone number also in that place. Anyway, you, you so they give you M-Pesa. They, they have a pay bill, I think. So you pay through pay bill, a business number, yeah. Uh, and the fee to collect, yeah, there's a fee to collect your passport. is 180 shillings. So you pay there and they give you, you open it, you check that it's okay. And now I'm the owner of a passport. I have my vlogmas. Day one was a success. Now I have to edit this video. It's around something going to nine o'clock. So I'll just put it up and I hope you guys watch and appreciate. Oh my God, help me be consistent. Dear Lord, please help me. Let's do this. See you in the next video. <laughs>